What's going on YouTube? Your boy Sneak and I'm back with another product review. Today we got wireless sport earphones made by Black Web. Um, they're Bluetooth. They're splash proof. Got a built-in microphone and as you can see have a 10 hour battery life. Um, I'm not super duper familiar with the splash proof ratings but if you know um, if you're familiar there you go IP X4 or IP times 4 however you say it um so i've had these for a couple months now and i use them pretty much every day during the week um working out at the gym um so step into this review before we get into it um i just want to put out there that i'm not sponsored by black web they didn't send me this product i spent my own hard-earned money on it so this is going to be an honest customer review for these um and I've already, like I said, I've been using them already. They're taken out of this box. I just kept the box. So, um, I should open it up. It has a light, nice little visual in here for you to, you know, see some things. Like I said, that 10 hour talk time, 10 hour music play time, which is, you know, grand amount of time for the charge to last and five day standby time. Um, throw that to the side. So, um, yeah, I'd rather show y'all the actual earphones than to be looking at that. So let's open this up. And this actually comes with this carrying case right here. Um, zip it up and it's, you know, pretty hard. So it'll protect them. You don't got to worry about getting them smushed or anything like that. So what it comes with in the box is, like I said, this case. And here are the earphones. Um, they're labeled here the for the right ear and this is for the left ear I switch those around and pretty much what you do is you hook this part around your ear and this goes in your ear hole and this little pad right here stop stop them from going in too far um, so the way you wear them is pretty much you can send this wire or the way I wear them at least send this wire around the back of my head and neck and Put them forward, loop, loop them around the ear, put them in, and um, they're pretty much good to go. Um, when I when I got this, it did come with, let's see, it did come with this little adjustable, it's like a rubber adjustability clip type thing, I guess, which, um, you know, you can use to, if you want to adjust them and cinch this you know pretty much keep it tight if you want to adjust them around the back of your head and cinch the back part really close you can do that like i said that's what this is for um i just find it more comfortable to not have it on there i just i have a lot of hair so i just let it hang free um and it also comes with these these are additional ear tips and ear pads so the size that comes on the earphones when you first get them i believe the medium size and so you have two extras of each these are the tips um pretty much as soon as i got them i swapped them out for the smallest size ear tip that they had in here which is what i found to be the most comfortable and you see this bag isn't open i kept on the original ear pad size so you know, like I said, it comes with the what would be their medium size on there, and then in your bag you'll have the smaller size, the small size, and the large size. Um, so, for me personally, you know, pad was fine, but I preferred the smallest ear tip that it had. Um, so it also comes with your charging cable right here, and it does not come with a charging base. So that's one thing you will need, but you probably have that already. Um, it accepts the USB port or uh, it had the USB end on it. So anything that accepts the USB um, receiver will charge this. That's your, your iPhone base, you know, Apple base. If you got a Mac, MacBook or whatever, um, or, you know, you charge, plug it into your computer and charge also. Here is the the end of the charging tip that goes into the earphones. Not sure what this one is called. If you know 
um, you go ahead and leave it in the comment section or, you know, just, just for you to see what the end looks like. But so pretty much the functions of the headphones. So I have this cable in my hand. I'll show y'all this first on your right earphone um, on the bottom. You lift this little flap up and that's where you plug it in to charge at right there. Boop. And it'll stay closed for you pretty much. Um, so I should have already told y'all how to put these on. You know, it's labeled left and right. On your right, right here in the front, that little hole, that's your microphone. Um, on the top, you can use these up and down buttons. Forward would be up and backwards would be down, you know, for your volume. Or if you hold it for a couple seconds, it'll go to the next song. You hold it back for a couple seconds, it'll go back to your previous song. This is your power button right here. Hold for a couple seconds, it'll turn on. Hold for a couple seconds, it'll turn off. And you are able to talk on the phone with these. Like I said, it has your microphone. So um, if you get a call, an incoming call, you can choose to ignore or answer. And you can talk to people with these on. Or you just let it ring, I guess. Um, well, like I said, I've had these for a couple months. And I haven't had any issues with them. Um... For as far as the splash proof, I've used these getting extremely sweaty at the gym and, you know, had sweat drenched, dripping down my face and head and dripping all over these, you know, um, got done with the workout, took them off, um, wiped them off on my shirt and, you know, done that plenty of times and next time I'll use them, I've had no issues whatsoever. So, that's a good thing you know especially if you plan to use these for the gym or anything like that that they're splash proof um and i carry them around like this you know with the earphones in the charger in this case in my gym bag riding around doing whatever haven't had any issues with the case like i said it's pretty hard pretty stiff um it'll protect them and you know nothing's rolled over my gym shoes and smushes or anything like that and this is a it's a you know I think a really nice case. So I picked these earphones up from Walmart for about 15 bucks. I believe it was like 1488 before tax. Um, so for around 15 bucks, you can pick these up. Um, and I think it's a good buy. The, uh, I will say one thing, if you like to listen to extremely loud music, these are definitely not the loudest earphones that I've had um but I don't think that's a problem you know it's not like they're not putting out um a good volume you know all the way up it is a very very good volume just not the loudest that I've had um but I also don't like to put earphones like this all the way in my ear I don't like to jam them all the way down so that might contribute to them not um to the loudness that i've heard but it is quality sound um you know they're not staticky anything like that no issues with that you know quality sound um good level of volume and i would definitely recommend these for anybody looking to buy some earphones to be able to use at the gym um or any other you know for use for any other type of sports or whatever you're doing um, so like, like I said, they have the, the hook that goes around your ears or so pretty much keep them in place. You don't have to worry about these falling out or anything like that. Um, but pretty good product and for 15 bucks, um, you know, a great value. I'm sure they have them on amazon.com and stuff like that too. But I just went ahead and picked these up at Walmart when I saw them. Um, so yeah, I'll give this one a thumbs up. Um, if this review helped you out at all, please go ahead and leave a like for me. Um, if you got any questions, scroll down to the comments and, um, go ahead and ask away and I'll try to get back to everyone if I can. Um, yeah, other than that, go ahead and scroll down, hit the subscribe button to go ahead and show some love and support the channel. Um, and I will see y'all on the next one. Peace out. Squat.